streets of London doop on the streets of Birmingham. Hello, today's tutorial is going to be for victory rolls for gals who have shorter hair because it can be a little bit tricky, um, especially if you have any kind of bangs or layering in the front section of the hairstyle. So um, if you would like to know how to do victory rolls on short hair, go ahead and keep watching. All right, so for this hairstyle, I have wrapped the front sections of my hair that are going to be in a victory roll around a small um, velcro roller. You can also use a sponge roller if you like. But the kind of idea here is to curl the hair kind of approximately where you want it to be in the victory roll so that your hair is already really encouraged to go in that direction. And the rest of my hair I have just pin curled. So let's go ahead and take out our pin curls and see how it looks. All right, so the first thing we wanna do is start to just brush out these front sections a little bit. Not a whole lot, just kinda of break up the curl a little bit. And then we'll go through and give everything else just a real quick initial brush through. Okay, so next we're going to use a little bit of dry shampoo as a base for our teasing. So you just want to take those front sections and we're just going to spray kind of near the root in the back area. Particularly if you're a brunette like me because this will leave white, little white powder. And we don't want that showing on the outside of the roll. Alright, so now we're just going to take our comb and just do a little bit of gentle teasing, always teasing in the same direction. It's a little bit gentler on the hair. So now we kind of have lots of volume that we can play with for our victory rolls. Alright, so we're just going to gently smooth the outside of the hair. Start brushing the ends into our victory roll shape. The hair is going to naturally want to go this direction and we're just going to start rolling till we get our victory roll approximately where we want it. You can go in with some bobby pins and start pinning. You really want enough pins so that your roll is nice and secure. All right, so now we have one little roll. And then the other side. Now, victory rolls do take a lot, a lot of practice. So if, especially on short hair, so if you've never done them before, don't give up. You just need some more practice. So, this side. And we want to, they don't need to be exactly the same size, especially if you part it on the side, but you do want them to be approximately the same distance back on your head so you don't have like one way up here or way back there. You can see those ends again, just curling right into the victory roll shape. So I'm having a little bit of trouble with the bangs, which is normal. So I'm just taking a little bit off the side and 
attempting to place the roll a little bit higher on my head where those little side hairs are just too short. But don't worry because we will be back for them. And then a little bit bigger. There we go. Once you have your roll again, approximately where you want it, and start pinning. And once you get a pin or two in, then you can really let go and just fine tune the placement. Just kind of pulling it open a little bit because I want it to be just a smidge bigger than it was. All right, so now we're going to take this hair down here that was too short to make it in this big side of the victory roll. And what you want to do is you want to pull it upward so that this part is nice and smooth like it would be if it did make it into the victory roll. And we're just going to roll it into a small pink curl until you get right to the base of the victory roll and then you're going to tuck your little curl up into the victory roll and pin it. Just like so. Oops. I'm going to aim a little bit more into the victory roll. So we can start to see it looks a little bit more like it belongs there. Now you gotta do is take your comb and gently smooth all the sections together so we have one continuous roll so that those hairs are kinda hidden up in the victory roll. Okay, so let me get the crazy ones out of the way. See? Alrighty, and then very carefully around the victory rolls, we're just going to brush out the rest around your hand until you kind of have the curls tamed as you like. I don't necessarily like mine to be like page boy style, but I do like them to be a little bit more controlled for a 40s look. rolls a little poofy at the bottom so I'm just gonna pin just to help contain a smidge of the volume and always angle your pins so that they're hiding inside the victory roll that'll help make it look a little nicer go And then of course we want to finish off with some hairspray to help hold these rolls in place. And then one thing, other thing you can do to help with the victory rolls is actually spray a little bit inside the roll. It's okay. It might seem like a little bit much hairspray, but it's inside. And so we don't care if the inside is crunchy because we're not going to be looking in there. Then just smooth any frizzies. There you go. That is our victory rolls for short hair tutorial. Thanks for watching.